Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panthervision. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to work with the mixer brush tool. I mean, how to paint with the mixer brush tool. As you can see, you can do some text work, some font. It's pretty difficult, by the way, because it doesn't have pressure sensitivity. Or you can do a stick man, I don't know. You can go creative and uh, do something with that. <laughs> First step, let's uncheck this little lock with the background, which is containing the, you know, the white background. Let's create a new layer, which is located right here. Let's uncheck the white background. Oh, by the way, let's just paint this uh, black, okay? So here is the basic colors. You got the black and white. If you don't have the black and white, you can just click on this thing here and you're gonna swap it to black and right uh, black and white let's select the paint bucket tool and paint it black we're gonna uncheck this background it's very important to uncheck the black background and let's go to the back to the layer and now we're gonna paint something we're gonna paint something colorful so let's select the brush tool not the mixer brush tool just the brush tool okay I'm gonna increase the size of the brush. Let's select some color. So you also have the swatches. You can go to windows and select the swatches. There's like a ton of colors, hopefully in here. <laughs> I'm gonna choose a color. I'm gonna go, I'm thinking to go with some rainbow-ish kind of vibes. I gotta go to the filter, blur, Gaussian blur. I'm gonna blur this out a little to see what happens. Whoa, that's too much, way too much. Yeah, something like this, something like this to be blurred out pretty good. I'm gonna create also a new copy. I can drag it to the little plus. Yeah, it's mainly does the same thing. I'm gonna select both by pressing and holding shift, right click, merge layers. So this is the pattern. I'm gonna go wild and select the lasso tool, okay? And I'm just gonna create something funky. I don't know what is this, don't ask me. I'm just gonna press control C and then control V. I'm gonna uncheck the original one and we're gonna be left with this weird thing here. So now we're gonna to go to the mixer brush tool. We're gonna to select it and go here, select clean brush. Make sure this is checked, this is checked. The wet is 100, load is 100, mix is 100, load is 100. And also make sure this sample all layers is also checked. I'm gonna press and hold Alt, of course increase the brush size like this again i'm gonna press and hold alt again and you can see it's gonna take the form so as you can see here is the form right now and uh now i got the paint uh you know i'm gonna uncheck this i'm gonna create a new layer i'm gonna scale down uh, the brush size and now you can paint check this out see that Actually, I'm gonna use the tablet to see what happens. Yeah, there you go. So it's gonna work a little bit slow because it doesn't have the pressure sensitivity. Uh, with pressure sensitivity, as you can see, everything is turned off. If I activate the pen pressure, by the way, and I'm gonna try to draw something, it's gonna remove the colors. So it's gonna work uh, really easily. It's gonna it's gonna be fluid so uh, if you act deactivate the pan pressure put it on off then it's going to make it with the full color this was it thanks for watching uh if you are new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get uh, notified with updates and don't, for don't forget to check out the other videos as well have a good one bye bye